Big changes coming for families of Emmett schools this year. I'm your Emmett neighborhood reporter, Alexander Huddleston, and I spoke with families about what they think about students getting shorter weeks but longer days. The class time is sacred. That time has to be there. Starting this August, students of Emmett schools will only be in class Mondays through Thursdays due to the district adopting a four-day school schedule. Superintendent Craig Woods said they released the change to the community last spring. We found that the culture and climate in those buildings improved because they, the, the kids came in more rested. Um, they came in, you know, ready to go and energetic on a Monday because they had that three days. They had a chance to be with their family on, on Friday, Saturday and Sunday. The same thing with our staff. But with one less school day during the week, school days will get longer Monday through Thursday. For the secondary, they, instead of starting at 745, they're going to start at 740, I believe. Um, and the elementary starts 20 minutes early. Superintendent Woods explained that the release times will also change slightly. So I went out around town to talk to parents. Many said off camera that they were on board with the schedule change. I agree with it. I think it would work well for the kids. I don't really, and the hours aren't changing all that much. And so my oldest I know is excited to have Fridays off to enjoy with us and her other family. And what about bus schedules? Well, Superintendent Woods explained that the district will be picking up the bus right app to allow parents to see when and where their child's bus will be picking them up and dropping them off. They'll know um, as that route is coming, if that bus is running three minutes late, if they, they, they'll be able to look at the app and go, hey, my bus is a little bit late, or hey, it's coming early, I better go out and walk out to the road to, to get my kids. This app will also help substitute drivers drive the route with ease instead of trying to learn from stop to stop, creating consistency for parents and staff. Many families that I spoke to off camera do agree that they hope schools can have some kind of after school program so that, especially for those families who aren't going to be around for when the kids are released. I'm your Emmett neighborhood reporter, Alexander Huddleston, Idaho News 6.